yo rod here futures 8 bit it's all go you know um got a few moments because there's a cnc running in my utility room and the chap on the internet's watching it for me this is giving me that few moments hopefully to try out these new um atari clone 2600 joysticks i've bought off of the internets you know we've all seen them um i bought these though for a good reason and that is because i keep playing this freaking game and doing really badly at it and i'm blaming my tools like any other proper person should um so this is me trying to prove Ooh, i'm useless basically yeah, this is me trying to figure out if um, it makes more sense to pay attention. Makes more sense to pay attention. No, I am and just need it. Yeah, because yeah, like I said, my 2600 joystick, I've refurbed it a few times, but I can't get the up. The up's not working quite right. I can't get the position just, just so. Ugh. So I reverted to using a, a refurbished slick stick, which is one of those uh, metal pole, I did that on purpose, metal pole joysticks in the middle. And I always find the um, contacts and them aren't that positive, and I don't, you know, I'm not a fan basically, but oh damn it. Don't think it's the joystick that's the problem. I'm going to... Just, just not funny. Right, I'm now facing the telly square on, and it's not a telly. It's a genuine Commodore 1701 monitor. Right, okay, I'm watching this square on now, so the old me should be able to cope with this. I'm sure I would have played this from the other side of the room when I was a quee boy and boy. Off. Right, okay, that's that done. Oops. I've done it again. He did it again. How'd you die? I forgot to set fire to the thing. See, you, you, you can't... It's not, it's not the tool, is it? No, it is the tool. It's the tool operating the tools. Now, ooh, do you know what? Already, I am noting, noticing rubber creep. Where the, the top of the joystick is actually already walking away from the shaft. Oh, joystick. Oh, shaft. Suit you. Yeah, okay, so I've already found one floor. They're clearly using an actual rubberized plastic rather than actual... It was basically... I don't know what type of rubberized plastic it was back in the day, but... It was firmer than this, is what I'm saying. Right, now, set fire to this with your stinky breath. Now give it a kick. There you go. Now get back in a hurry. Because there's a geezer desperately trying to D somewhere down the bottom. But first, I need to change weapon. There we go. To wibbly wobbly. Get at least two shots in. Come back. One, two, three, four. Oh, nice. One, two. Ooh, that'll have to do. One, two, three, four. Or three. Need to get them in. Feed those shots. I said shots. Yeah, my voice is really croaky again today, because seriously, this week it's just been on the phone. Not too much shouting, but honestly, it is so relentless now. Right, so you got to jump in when this comes off, otherwise it's a disaster. Jump! Oh, yes! Okay, I think the joystick does help. Nice blue clouds. Blue clouds, no blue sky. White and grey clouds. Oh yeah, now I remember. So you hold down fire to lock position, so you have to just bounce this across, and it's quite easy, because it's just two positions you have to go in. Three. And then straight back across again. Generally, this is the sort of level you get onto, and you've already lost all of your lives. And I don't know what the book is for, and I don't know how you get it. Maybe you've got to bounce the geezer dead straight again, but I ain't risking anything. I just want to progress. Nice colourful level, this. The blue at the bottom there. How does it look on capture? Yeah, quite good. So, yeah, I don't know if I'll put these joysticks in the store. I, I want to. Because people can't get hold of joysticks very easily sometimes. And if you're already buying from the store anyway, but... You know. I'm not sure if I should. 
I'll see what other um, people with VAT numbers sell them because I think it's basically that. If you're if you're a nobody, it really doesn't matter. But if you've got a proper business, it's probably not worth the risk. All right, done that level. My stupid computer keeps locking its screen, even though the registry's been fixed to stop it from doing that. Right, okay, level three. I don't even know what. <gasps> Seriously, I might not have ever been on level three. This is all new to me. So we've done torture, interlude, and we've got three lives left. So we've got torture two. But yeah, more loading. All new to me, I think. <laughs> Dear Commodore, thanks for having a bug in your loading. Right. Here we go, torture screen two. Oh, hello. Shoot you. Jump there. I, surely if I jump down there, I will D, but I reckon I can slide down that. Yep, I oh, thought so. And then D, right. Bomb, bomb. Acme snowballs. I'll give you snowball. Ah. Uh, Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, another way of Ding. Right, so I'm, I reckon I've got to get over here, stand on this stone. I can't stand on. I stand there. Oh right, I can move the stone. Do you know I don't think I've ever been on this level. And I'm about to die as well. Now I know I can move the stone. Don't die. Right, so that means I can now go down there like this, way, and then bounce back on to... No, that didn't work. Okay, well, that was the joystick test. So, yeah, uh, if you visit the store, you might find some Atari uh, clone joysticks. I have to think of another name for them that isn't Atari. Tramel joysticks. Yeah, you might search for Tramel joysticks. That might be a way of you finding them. Right, I'm going to get back to my CNC until the next time. Good.